man. That shit be real, bro. We back in another week, another episode, man. Hey, we gonna start by saying if you start off a sentence just saying, "Hey, I hate to ask you this," you don't hate it too bad. If you proceed to ask, man, you don't hate it too bad. If you say that, then don't do it for real, man. But nah, we back another week, another episode, man. Uh, we in here, man. More dope ass content, man. Dope ass episodes. We've been doing a lot of shit. Trying to get everything situated for our fans, man. Coming off of goddamn, what this is, a classic weekend, man. Hey, yeah, yeah, they said that shit was crazy. I ain't participate, but I'm sure we're gonna find out what happened, man. But hey, we made it back. We glad everybody's safe. We glad everything went well, man. So definitely wanna shout out to that. Before we get started, man, we definitely wanna say shout out YouTube.com for hosting our podcast, man. We appreciate everybody who liked and subscribing, uh, commenting, and all that good stuff, especially on the shorts. A lot of people starting to like the YouTube short, so we definitely gonna give y'all a lot more of that. So definitely go like, subscribe, and follow us on YouTube, Righteous Media Group. You can find all our stuff there as well as Instagram, Righteously the Podcast. We appreciate you. Also, like new window cleaning. Hit my dog, 205-427-0303. Hey, get your free estimates, commercial or residential. Get your shit looking like new. You got any other requests, ask him when you get those. See how you feel, man. Uh, it might work out for you that way, man. We definitely got merch on the way back. Give us a week. We got merch on the way. That's my word. Please give us a week. We got merch. Shopify site will be back up. And we got a couple t-shirts on hand for anybody who want to hit us. Check us out. Um, we definitely got that going. So now that we got that out the way, man, y'all checking about class weekend. Y'all participating in the class. She laughing. She must have had a ball out this huh? <laughs> Somewhat. What you mean, something with shit? That don't sound like you, goddamn. Yeah, no, man. No, nah, I went all way out there. I went out and shit, and I was drunk, but goddamn, I ain't go to the Eden Field, no shit. Yeah. But um, I went on third Saturday night. You say you went on third? Yeah. Oh, like everybody be hanging out and shit? Yeah, I went out there. <clears throat> young nigga crazy, man. Good. You, know, you said the young nigga crazy. Yeah, yeah. Damn. You been saying that, though. Yeah, them niggas that crazy. Them niggas out this bitch, they that motherfucker on oh, what that shit? Oh, uh, Gaza. Well, and what? What they had a war at right now? Oh, yeah, man, he's really loud. Stand them goddamn uh, uh, AR pistols and shit, with ski masks on the goddamn side of the street. I was scared. That nigga said I was scared. <laughs> now, for real, that sound about right though. Shit, I ain't got damn have no gun with me, goddamn. I wonder why niggas so brave. I ain't gonna say so brave, but like, what's the point? I guess to just pose a threat, not pose a threat, but the the flick. Don't come over here, like man. I had him in the only read, like bro, just out that bitch. You see him, but just yeah, yeah, by this shit, they they fucking narcos. Like, yeah, like, when you were walking the narcos and they were yeah, like, shit, yeah. that a nigga was, but it's like weird. I heard ain't nothing, ain't nothing like having no shit though. Yeah, I I nobody got killed. That shit is weird. Though. You said <laughs> that shit is not weird. that type of place. Like they acting like we in a whole other country, like. Standing on top of a car with a gun and a ski mask on is crazy. It's all type of people. Some was people, a nigga shooting a video or something? No, like, he just in, he just chilling. Yeah, Crop Street got down. <laughs> That's just we what they be doing. Yeah, with the fire. Like, shit, I went like, down there, but I know how they be. Like I've yeah. been down there before, and they be they just be. Yeah, just for the fuck of it. Fuck it. <laughs> you think it's because these nigga really got got ops? Like these nigga Some really have a Yeah, they. I mean, but still, that nigga like shit. I'm gonna go out, but I'm yo, I don't know. Cause that my next point, like, shit. Okay, so if I do got ops at this hoe, why would I single myself out by standing up on some shit, <laughs> raised above everybody else, not to make nobody else know that shit security ain't cool, guard. but he the security guard for the niggas he with. She no, the crash shot nigga. I mean, but she, he better hope they got that he seen him before they seen him. That's what I'm saying. That's the point I'm getting at. Cause she. Once the hunt, the hunted, you know, <laughs> when the hunter becomes the hunted, she is old. I'm just like, man, I hope these niggas don't really get the hit, because, you know, you can't fucking go nowhere. Mm-hmm. I'm goddamn, these really niggas right here. I'm goddamn in the first lane next to the niggas. We got this little lane going their way, then they got the media and shit. Yeah. Is that the media right now? Hell no. It's just the other two lane cattle going their way. Right. That's you know, why I'm niggas got damn swerve nobe in the in the, going the wrong direction doing all this stupid shit. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, I did that stupid shit too. Mm. I ain't gonna lie. He said I did that stupid <laughs> shit too. I'm so nigga be living for that shit though, man. I heard I'm like I be hearing a lot of people like they like, bro, that's the that's like 
the end all be all to being up here. I'm like, you must be a real like local person. Like you probably ain't never been to no other shit. Cause I'm like, damn, this shit ain't like just a football game. They like, no, they have parade, they, they have game. Do the it's most. whole day. Like, like, like Brian Myers City School be out all this shit. Yeah, they be out the Friday of class six. They call it like a teacher development day or some shit. They call oh, I nigga done found an excuse <laughs> for the shit. Nah, that's dope. Prime man. the other day. But I, mean, I, I didn't experience like the whole outside. I went to Legion Field Saturday when I got off from work, Yo. and it was like packed as fuck. And then I had to work at the club Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah. And they was in a pop of shit. They popped that shit for the classic. Like, yeah. I'm talking about niggas is buying bottles back to back. They, them MC in the club calling them the Deleon boys, the 42 boys. Like, yeah. He was in a pop of shit for class. It's so packed in there. I, my voice sounds like this because I've been screaming, excuse me, excuse me, yeah. all weekend. Because people have been showing out for class. They love some class. Nigga probably save up all year for that shit, bro. <laughs> Yo, that's the sad. Man, that's the sad. I don't think I know about six of you probably. I don't think I know about two brands. No, they say it up. Y'all be like, say it with two brands, go somewhere else. Yeah. Oh, this shit right here at the we grill. Can, yeah, we finna save up these 2,000 for goddamn it. When yeah. we, yeah. we get three bottles, so. you can get three bottles. Yeah. You can get three bottles. Yeah. That's yeah. wild as fuck. be in there buying the bottles like that. They usually be in there all the time, but like often. Yeah. That's, but yeah, yeah, they do do the most. It was... They, it be a lot of popping shit, but it, as many people as it was in the club, that was yeah. a, a ridiculous. Like, shout I out to all them folks made some money, man. man. No nigga made some crazy money in the club. Bottle of Patron, three fifty and shit. Nigga, you can get that shit fifty dollars at the store. <laughs> nigga, oh nigga, they made crazy shout profit. Out to the niggas out, who be tipping. Yo, man, shout out to everybody for a safe weekend, man. I, yeah, I definitely sure. want to shout out to everybody. Came home, safe, 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 safe weekend, man. That I didn't shit hear nothing dope. crazy. Yeah. So that's a blessing. Yeah, so we didn't hear about it. That shit was super personal and out the way. Man. So I definitely, I definitely commend that, man. But hey, man, so I, I got some, some touchy shit, man. You're a music artist, right? Mm. So would you say that promoting your music is one of the most important parts of your career as an artist? It's one of them, yeah. For yeah, sure. for sure. Because you're supposed to promote yourself, just period, as a brand, and that's supposed to bring people's interest to your music. Or if they fuck with you for the music, then you got to be doing something to put it in their face for them to know, like, yeah. you need to listen. I if, feel you don't put it in their, if you don't put it in their face, they're not going to go out their way to l- listen to you if they don't fuck with you. Yeah. That make a lot of sense, man. I asked because I seen a nigga online. Was put almost two hundred thousand dollars into a promo of his music, and nobody knows who he is. Oh, I know you talking about. I, I like thought I was the only. Yeah, I thought I was the only person who like two hundred thousand. He's a Birdman person. Nah, hell no. Nah. <laughs> hell no. Nah. I hope not. Shit, nah. I think he's from Texas or something. Mm-hmm. But I mean, his whole his whole thing was his video was the fact he was like, bro, I put one hundred seventy seven k in the promo of my shit. And niggas ain't doing what I'm doing and all this shit. And everybody was like. I mean, at that point, if you're putting that much money in and nobody's fucking with you, it's definitely a lot of different career fields out there like that you could yeah. possibly go in. Me and Cud like 38. He like somewhere up in there. He okay, like an now. older, he like unk type of thing. <laughs> they better start making some of them uh, so the so so uh cookout music song. <laughs> yeah. God, so the so like this so <laughs> my side piece. <laughs> yeah. My boy gotta pull the King George out there. Yeah, oh, yeah. Man. You better make one of those songs. One of them goddamn dance after the shit. I would say, shit, start. Why not start a label? I always try to start a label. You wanna be a rapper though? You can't tell the man that nigga wants to be a rapper, so you can't tell him the goddamn. You feel me? Nah, they gotta be a business man to start it. No, he wanna be a fucking rapper. Bro, start a label, bro. Like, you start to a construction stuff, though, Like, on the side, just in case. <laughs> but I'm saying for a nigga to <laughs> have it. He probably already got the money. If he I got 177 bands. Yeah. If you got 177 more bands after you spend 177, yeah. okay, you can keep doing what you do. But if like, after man. that, you're reaching in your pocket now, you're like, damn, like, I ain't got no fans. I said it. it was on the video like, hey man, I put a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> now I be saying like I'm so yeah, but this shit ain't nah. I need to go goddamn check this other shit out I got. Or was he like He went on that shit like that? Oh, he was okay. like see it like basically ain't nobody doing what I'm doing like I'm an independent artist nigga. I put two hundred bands to my music, promo on my shit, whatever. But exactly. it was nobody just funny that nobody doing. knew who the fuck he was. Yeah. Nobody's doing that. I'm like, or oh, if you wanted to be a rapper, you need to come up. Like, get you a blimp. You can get you a goddamn. You need to get, 
He need to chop something else. I don't want to sell something. Maybe you promote a different way. You can say hey, you say the name. Like, hey, announcer, can you just? <laughs> yeah. You I got can some, have niggas bro. 15,000. Play this bit for 15 seconds. Say my name at the end. 200,000, bro. You got some convincing money. Like, you can. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can convince them all over 100,000. You can break that shit down yeah. over a couple of places and get some shit done. You can bro. pay people to listen to your shit. Yeah. You force them to download it on you. Get you a hacker, nigga, tap him to the radio station and just have him spin oh. that bitch once a day. I'm going to the club and got the, yeah. hey, man, play this bitch five times tonight. Like, nigga, on, I get for you 1500 got You did. Come on, bro. Like, that shit. Nigga, you could pay one of them, them nigga who, when you go in the club, don't let them be on your car when you come back out. Them bitches be on everybody. You can go pay some of them shit. Like, bro. Yeah, but don't introduce me. <laughs> yeah. Pay that whole, all right, after the hottest song you finna play. Yeah, just when you play out there that sexy red, got to drop me right in between. Got that. <laughs> hey, shit. Just let that bitch keep riding, guys. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, nigga. Get the crowd. I mean, you know, you see yeah. the DJ, so the crowd get it going off. You feel me? Man. Play the other shit again. But yo, look later on, drop this one again. Got to, bro. I'm like, damn, nigga. And it's so funny, but I'm like, too. I mean, people know who he is now because of the story. You feel me? Like, had it not made it to it, made it to, we wouldn't even be talking about it. But it's just the fact that, again, nigga, if you got that much paper, bro, like, it's other. I would have got to about, well, let me ask y'all, at what point do you start? Like, what's your monetary? number you would have got to it depends if i don't have no shit i don't like to put a deadline on no shit but yeah. like at shit like 30 and if nothing has shook i'm i it, at I'm 30 bands pretty, no oh 30 bands i yeah. thought you were saying age wise no nah, that too oh. i mean he is 38 but she is. yeah 38 nigga come yeah. on now money wise where do you start out of, if you got two hundred thousand and you promote Money shit, wise. where do you stop when you like, bro? I done put this much in. Depending on what the money, how much money do I have? One hundred seventy-seven. Oh, I would stop way before. I <laughs> oh, I'm not, I'm not going all out with the one hundred seventy-seven. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, you might get me to do seven. Yeah, I, I yeah. You know me. Hey, shit, ain't but, a yeah, lot. So I'm team. actually an artist who loves to rap. That's man. true, though. That's I've true. Been yeah. Rapping since. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, see, and they can't nobody tell you that that's probably the same thing to say yeah, with Buddy. Yeah, he like, and I, I am an artist who loves rock. Yeah. And you complaining about it and crying about it. You a grown ass man. Yeah. At 38. I don't know, bro. I would have just found one of my nephews or something, but like, hey, bro, I'm gonna get you I'm gonna get you the whole little kit. Get you some designer. Get you a little chain that be about to be more tonight with you. You just trying to get on. See, that big be real because <laughs> <laughs> Shit, we're gonna rent us a couple of cars. We're gonna shoot, get us a night. We can get about two good, nice rooms at the Grand Bohemian or some shit. Man, you got now a song about killing, killing a couple niggas. Mm. About two minutes, 30 minutes, a two minute, 30 second song. Facts. Nigga got 177 bands. Cause I'm like, damn, bro, that shit made me sad. I'm like, bro, you could have bought a semi truck, bro. You could have had a chicken bit. Well, you right. You right. I would hope so. Because a nigga do got I'm too many man. We, we count that part. Probably like, cause I ride just want to rap out this old. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all niggas can't fucking stop me out. Yeah. I didn't probably about how I been told him. Yeah. I don't know why. Should, why I'm Boogie Bell still trying to goddamn put them songs That's out? So weird. Yeah. He ain't probably talking tell. about you ever heard one of his songs? You still ain't heard the song. <laughs> no, I still ain't heard that shit. Yeah. I wanted to see how the nigga like what he was rapping about. That's what I'm like. He should have been playing a song in the background <laughs> of the video. At least you would have been getting the plays from niggas. You know that nigga was. Hey, somebody would have been like, shit, the song he playing kind of hard. Yeah, and go look you up. Like he was just on that bitch showing his phone, and he was like, bro, I done spent this much promo on my shit. Y'all nigga act like I ain't woo woo. Y'all can't do what I do. I'm like, okay, so he promo went wrong. Yeah, I mean, like, he did good with the, with the video, but like, on, yeah, bro. if you weren't playing your music while you talking about the shit, yeah, you're not, <laughs> you're not promoting, right? You might have been promoting, goddamn. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You probably have a shirt on, shit, some on. shit. So, well, goddamn, he really been goddamn. Somebody can't play no music right now, bro. Look at old folks, oh, goddamn. I'm telling you, he went about that shit all the way wrong. I hope he stopped. I hope he ain't just like, I don't know, bro, because this shit said 200 clicks. Like he showed the little Instagram shit, you know, you can get the analytics and shit. It was like 200 clicks. This shit was like 100 some, like 10,000 some impressions. And then nigga that spent 170 some bands, cuz. These so niggas who ain't spent the quarter to get more than that, bro. Like, come on, bro. I was like, yeah, that's crazy. Unless his analytics just fucked up. That shit is crazy. Don't put 200,000 in the shit without no return. 10,000, I'd have been like, all right, so maybe I need to. 
Okay. Did you get it was some of that promo and feature? I don't know. You gonna have a feature of son of Yeah, you should fucking... go on pay little baby or somebody got a nigga. Hey bro, I'm gonna give you I'm gonna give you goddamn a hundred bands, bro. Just yeah. fuck it. See, we're gonna push this song like a motherfucker, boy. Fuck it. No, you can't just go out there on a the whim trying to do that. But shout out to him though, man. Keep going. And they should have been like, at least with Fade. You shouldn't have got it without that. Bro, did to y'all strike, see? Try to sign the Star Spangled Banner. I was just about to say, did y'all see him singing the Star Spangled Banner? I did not see it. I heard about it. Oh, man. Man. he could have played. Yeah, he could have played them niggas. Hey, look, you um, yeah. rock his eye. You got a nigga hundred man. Got let me sign the Star Spangled Banner. Out there, Somebody said, whenever you actually get the job, you apply for on Indeed when you want to really qualify. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, yeah. Shit, I'm surprised he knew that bitch. Oh my! I think God. nigga had to rehearse that bit though. That's he probably, he probably had to rehearse that motherfucker so many times. It was so funny, like he didn't fuck up. It was just, I was weak the it's whole time. Like, what? To him. Yeah, who idea was that? Like who arranged it? I'm gonna take this nigga from Milwaukee, like who? <laughs> yeah. Like who called it him and was like, hey, bro, we gotta get the camera on everybody. everybody just, <laughs> <laughs> the little boy was like. <laughs> He didn't know what the fuck was going on. He's like, wait, is this a joke? Yo, that's crazy. Oh my god, that's wild as fuck. <laughs> Nigga, like, oh, shit, hey, play, we got a little, we got I, a gig. That's a game. Tonight, they bro. probably would have kicked me out. I would have been weak. My boy had a gig out there. this whole goddamn. Yeah. Been crying during this but maybe the main nigga just got fucked up or something. Nigga, and like, hey, I know like, we want to put the public in. Yeah, but I don't see why the fuck they get your knee. They got his ass. Yeah, nigga could have found out. somebody in the crowd saying better than that. <laughs> see, I know a little auntie, somebody out that be with a guy down. Woo. Yeah, not flayed though. I that see shit went on here with a nigga. What they said? Oh, oh, what's that? <laughs> what? I've never heard nobody. You should have just rap bitch. Like, Jay I Rabbit, really feel bro. like that's what they thought he was gonna do. I thought he was gonna do some. I, I thought he was gonna do some nigga shit. I thought you know at the end when they say in the home with the brave. Yeah, I thought he was gonna say in the home with slave, with slave. He should have did yeah. that. Yeah. The sun got there, but he yeah. right. But the white folk would have went crazy. Now, the boy disrespect America. But it wouldn't have been no basketball game yesterday. Would have turned the lights out. I don't veterans and shit in there, but you know they be ready to prove a point. No, fuck no. He we won't got not America, not fucking America. We at war. <laughs> Hell no. We at war too? Hell no, bro. That would have got had his ass no, hanging from years old like this. Whole. Not this one. <laughs> not fucking this one. You <laughs> won't disrespect the flag like that. <laughs> yeah, not here. Not here, fucker. You take that shit. Not in America. Up. Take that <laughs> shit back up to New York. <laughs> shit, but them fuck wouldn't have flag wouldn't have made it out of that. Ooh. Shit, no. They would have had <laughs> it rubbing on his ass like that log get them polos. He'd have been dead. But nah, oh I'm glad God. he didn't do no bullshit though. But he that didn't fuck it up. I'm about to say he fucked it up. This shit was that funny. Just seeing him saying it. Yeah. When I heard that shit, I said, "What?" I was like, "Nah, somebody bullshit." I'm thinking this is uh, 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 what they call that shit on TikTok. Fuck, we making them reenacting oh, videos and shit. Yo, nigga said, "Nah, he right." It's I don't just the bitch. fact that I think everybody used to watch him when we were younger. So it's just like, yo, with that flavor love shit. What? Yeah, everybody. And then you cut your ass up just saying it. The oh big ass God. clock on. You still, yeah. hey, I ain't gonna lie. That one nigga that stuck to it. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga kept them goals and kept them guys, man. <laughs> kept the big ass pocket out there. Yeah. You know, I'm like, bro, like, Flavor Flay, when you wouldn't even know singer when you was an artist. Why would you do that? I'm gonna think he was an artist. I think he was always like the hype man type shit. Yeah, so why would you, like, that shit, that shit was a last minute this season. Somebody else has made it last yeah, minute. Somebody else is getting get? fired. Yeah. <laughs> or maybe he did it on his own. They looked around and was like, <laughs> <laughs> shit, he's. Fuck, just let him roll, let him roll, let him roll. Taylor Swift's gonna come out here and do it. God damn, he on that bitch. Oh, say, can you? He's like, what the fuck? Yeah, oh, no, that shit. man said, and now we're going to have the Star Spangled Banner by Flavor Flav. That's, that's crazy, that's bro. That, no, nah. that shit a joke. That shit right to entertainment. That shit a joke. That's why they be fucking us over on them policy The basketball players is. Them niggas letting you know, like, hey, bro, we playing in your favor. I ain't gonna lie, that shit shit still one further than the Fergus shit, though. What you mean? Was it her? Was it Fergie? When they did Star Strangle on Donald Team USA? I don't know. I don't know. It's on football field. No, it was at the basketball game. And I, I heard it was funny. She fucked up bad. Hell yeah. You thought Flay Flay couldn't say shit. Damn. Her voice was cracking and shit. Hell yeah. Damn. Oh, that shit. You can see them niggas like on some. They show it on the camera. They're like. 
Is it probably a little I'm, bad night? I think that was Fergie. Yeah. We might have to look it up. We gotta Fergie, we gotta yeah. research that shit. Yeah, I think with Fergie with her, with her shit. Her shit was funny. Yeah. That's crazy. That shit probably nerve wracking though. All them folks in that big ass arena and you got to get the words right. Then you can hear yourself and shit. Ain't no beat. Like she fuck that. They used to fuck me up and I used to rap though. When I hear myself. When you can hear yourself, you don't like that part of recording. See, some people be like, turn that shit up. They be wanting to I hear themselves. I have to hear myself. Yeah. That shit say that I be shit. like, hey, I don't hear myself. It make you rap better? I, I guess. Yeah. I don't know. I just like to hear myself. I, I guess because I've always sang like with a microphone anyway. So yeah. I like to hear myself. Some people, that shit keep them in key when they can hear themselves. Yeah. yeah. I don't, that shit fuck me up when I can't hear myself. Yeah. It's just like, how do people do that? But um, yeah, that, that, that how they would look with goddamn with Fergie shit. Oh, he trying not to laugh and shit. That nigga Clay Thompson trying not to sneeze. That man look geek. Man, I did motherfucker week. That then it went over here and started laughing, goddamn. Hey, you think they get paid yeah, for that shit? Oh. Yeah, that nigga look like no. LeBron. He weak as fuck. Maybe that shit was a joke, bro. Hell no. Hey, nah. fuck that shit. I'm letting I'm let him hear it. Damn, hold on. I wonder if they get paid the same in that and after the events and shit. I feel like they don't. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty about the microphone. Oh, they ain't hear that bitch. Yeah. Well, that, cocaine, hey, that cocaine, <laughs> that cocaine kicked in good. That coke, but she probably in her head. She probably sounded good as fuck. Oh, she probably was seeing the music video, <laughs> all that shit. But that powder kicked in. That's that she good, probably, yeah. She probably like with a nigga. Uh, That's that good. With a nigga Wolf of Wall Street, nigga thought he drove with car home perfectly. Got that, and they got to the crib. He ripped the fuck out of Lumbo. <laughs> that good, yeah, nigga on my mama. Oh, I don't know if she do cocaine. Though. Yeah, I'm just, hey, that's that's allegedly. Oh, that's some good, yeah. I'm like, damn, first. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Hey, speaking of NBA players, though. Ah, oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah, he too big for that bullshit. Go ahead. I don't know what you finna say. Go ahead, bro. I just say he got there. They were like, he admits to uh, the White House, admits to, uh, you know, hitting up a dude, uh, dude, him up or something. Yeah. And sexual intercourse. But they talking about he raped the dude. The dude, somebody raped. Yeah, he, he said he going. fought. Well, hang on. Yeah. He said he, he raped. He said he fought. He forced him. He fought. Forced, forced, forced Yeah, he forced him to give him head and all oh, kind wow. of shit. But the nigga didn't deny the shit, bro. The nigga said, what goes on in my bedroom is with my bed. Oh, but you know, yeah. Business. Hey, but yeah, you know, goddamn. You said what? It ain't for it ain't for him to explain to nobody. I'm like, <laughs> see, oh, you, you think I explain it to the courts? Yeah, hell yeah, yeah. Now I hope he didn't forcefully take nothing from nobody, man or woman that ain't cool. But hey, man, I think people just more so like some I knew it type of shit. Man, man. I don't think nobody's surprised. They just more so like, damn, bro, man, I man. knew. Well, good plenty of evidence of of such alligator activity, goddamn. If we gonna speak in legalese, he definitely got a lot of videos of him doing some questionable things with the same gender. But hey, what the man do in his house and on his cell phone and whatever, oh, bro, that his whatever, whatever you man. Think, but yeah, oh, man, ducking the wrong balls out there. Yeah, I think niggas on some I told you so type of shit. Yo, he he fucked up, bro. Like, well, I ain't gonna say he fucked up. He fucked up if he took that, it. That was, uh, I think, who the was, Stephen A. Smith was saying? They like, he think, that's why team didn't give him. You know, the nigga like a free agent. Yeah. Like shit, like. He come with too much weird shit. Bro. I think they knew about that shit. You seen the he video, he be reached between to... the nigga legs on the sideline yeah. and shit. Like, what the fuck? Nigga uh-huh. sat down and grabbed the nigga nuts, like. In the middle of an NBA game, like that's crazy. Like, oh him. man, chill out. Yeah, then I'm like, the nigga sitting down. You were supposed to stop that bitch. You're supposed to stop the whole game. Fuck, fuck that. Find me, I mail you the check tomorrow, cause 
What? Well, man, I would have told, man, what happened with you in the way on side, man? You ain't seen that nigga try to grab a beat. What's yeah, that? for real. Yeah, What's fuck. Like, you shouldn't even much let you just fall and you try to catch something. That's yeah, the only guy that's, that's, that's the only way. But no. Nah, you don't need to grab my knee or nothing. Why you trying yeah. to grab? He 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 did like some not right here type of shit. Like yeah, he grabbed the hand like not right here. Nah, girl, be you do some freaky shit in the store or something it's like nigga pull my dress down. Nah, he looked on some <laughs> shit. Like nah, nigga, you a part. And he sat down. You a part of the clothesline, huh? Everybody in the front row part to spill they shit. I buy y'all some motherfucker. Mm. Oh god, nigga, <laughs> yeah, we supposed to be built everywhere, nigga. Popcorn, nigga, all kind of shit. Ralph blowing the whistle. You gonna sit down and grab my dick, bro? And we ain't never did no shit like this. You wait till all the ESPN cameras. That's I be thinking those niggas be out there. I don't on, know, bro. No, so, fuck that. Nah. Speaking along those lines, it yeah. was a dude who was in an interview and he had basically said that he would let a man suck his dick for like seventy thousand dollars. Damn. But he said he not gay. He said he would be laughing if a dude did that. Um. He would be laughing about a dude. He was like, he oh, he would be more, more so on some shit like, nigga, are you really going to do it type shit more than so like enjoyment? I don't know. So he on some like reverse psychology. He trying to psych himself. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, I don't know. He trying to convince this like, bro. Like, like, but it ain't like me, yeah, guys. For a certain amount of money, hell yeah. I let, I let That's like when you go to the gym, when you put a lot of weight on that bitch and just hold it first. Sitting there, you go put some light and shit on there and feel like you did a lot of time. Yeah, that one. He trying to convince yeah. yourself. Yeah. But so, hey, look, man. I can quit doing this shit whenever I feel like it, man. Hey, I don't gotta do, but got, man. Hey, man. Some niggas feel like that, bro. Like, right. That's, I mean, I, I don't know, bro. I don't see why niggas go out and say certain shit mm-hmm. publicly. Like, yeah, but they had his face blurred out and stuff. Yeah. And when people were saying that, they thought it was Joe Buddy. <laughs> <laughs> but shit, was Joe Buddy used to smoke license, crack, though, so shit, a- he might. He was like, shit, for the right amount of money, I'll let him do it. Hold on. But I'm not gay. I'm not gay. The crack. <laughs> this is saying the crack heads and got down on being gay coincide. I just know crack heads that do sexual things. Right, 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 some crazy ass shit. That's the same shit your buddy said. We was at work one day. Back in the day, but uh, he got a podcast. We stay down podcast. Shout out to bro. But goddamn, yeah. he was like, shit. He was like, hey, chill. He was like, you you'd rather be gay? Or you rather be a crackhead? <laughs> I said, man, pass me the pipe, man. He was like, shit. I'd probably rather be a. Uh, he said, nah, he he rises that alpha, but he was leaning the more on the goddamn he'd just be gay. He like, bro, you gonna be a crackhead? You gonna have to do some gay shit anyway. I ain't gonna say that. I'm not there, but if you gay, yeah, you gay. It'll become an option at some point. And they ain't out here doing all that. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, shit, bro, I'm gonna just work hard for my crap. My nigga will steal. Yeah. I'm gonna be a thief. Oh, God. That's the smart way to do it. Do tricks out this hole. I'm, I'm gonna learn how to do a good trick. Yeah. I'm gonna learn how to tell jokes. I'm gonna tell a nigga a good joke for $5 out this hole. Yeah, you're gonna learn a skill. Yeah, you feel me? That's true. That's true. Yeah, Yo, that shit just gotta already be in you, bro. If you want to do yeah, that, probably not you funny. just been wanting to do that. I ain't gonna lie. Just like, oh, I found a female crack dealer. Yeah, and just be like, shit, go on ahead and lick on her. Shit, fuck it. You gotta wanna do that, bro. I don't really believe that's just no. One day I woke up and thought about, it. nah, nah. Just like, buddy, we talking about. When he sat down and grabbed a man, shit, he wanted to do that. Or he been doing it. That ain't the first time. It was just the wrong time. So, yeah. Yo, oh. For real, but yeah. So you think people, you think it's a choice with crack? You think people like they want to do crack? Shit, if you born with that shit in your system, you might have some crack. <laughs> nah, what do you think the other reasons be? Like it's weed, the one reasons. Yeah, yeah. Experimental. some people it's just it's like, not... yeah, it's just different levels of high. Like nigga but be then, like, this ain't yeah. enough. I know niggas will go to rehab and the next week they be back on crack and they just be like, shit. Yeah, I'm like, they better. I'd rather be. That's just what it is. Everybody got their own poison shit. Everybody got their own shit. Yeah. yeah. But to some people, crack is fun. It's good. I done heard some good stories about crack. Some niggas I know personally who religiously smoke crack to this day. But crack, a uh, majority <clears throat> crackheads don't be having nowhere to live. So like, but fun, they live like the longest. Have, huh? They live forever. Yeah, that's cool and all, but you're what is like? What's fun? 
Like when you saying they be saying being on crack is fun. Like what's fun? Like it's an adventure. Like I was just shit the other day. Yeah, like, I all the time, so yeah, I say this shit all the time, bro. I got an uncle, bro. He smoked. He been on crack forever. As long as I can fucking remember, he's been on crack. This nigga literally goes to the bus station and he'll laugh and joke with whatever bus he see with the location he like. He laugh and joke with the bus driver until he can get on the bus. And he goes to wherever the bus go and shit. He gonna kick it up for a little bit, live, get a job, work, whatever. Then he quit that motherfucker, go to another bus station. This nigga traveling the world. He's seen more than the He's average hard working person. Head. That's not what crackheads do. Because they don't be getting jobs. <laughs> but he's smoking crack no. actively in the whole time. Yeah, I just think of passing the drugs. He's a, yeah, That's my whole, a, I don't know. What would you call That nigga worked for he's the Smithsonian. He's a functioning bro. crackhead. You say yeah, what? He These worked people. for the Smithsonian Museum in Virginia, bro. Like the fucking national artifact motherfucker. Yeah, like, work. yeah he work up there. He ain't employed, though. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, he be working. Once you nigga get on to him, because he gone. You feel me? Like, bro, yeah, yeah, when he out of options, he just do some petty shit and go to jail. Yeah, he's a nigga out there. Yeah, I pay all oh, dude right there to park. He's like, what dude? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right now, yeah. I paid him twenty dollars. Absolutely, and he'll be making you laugh the whole night to some shit. Well, I got, we got no parking attendant. The park is yeah. free. He gone out there. Some niggas, niggas be on some shit. Yeah, bro. that nigga wasn't employed. He was just working up there. Yeah. And he'll go to the nigga, he'll go to Greyhound, he'll be like, hmm. Hey, man, you know I'm working at Hollywood uh, Boulevard and got nah, yeah. you nigga. You went out there, they ain't give you no job, but uh, you were working on this. That dude. nigga be tripping, bro. That nigga go from DC to Houston. You know, he'll just slip on the bus, bro. I'm so that shit crazy fuck, but he don't have no roots or nowhere. Like he ain't got no kids, no house, no. I was rolling stone. I'm talking about bro for real. Wherever the fuck he stopped, that's where he at. Boy, jellyfish out this hole. When niggas don't got no goddamn, hey, he just go with the water out there. And he gonna make the best out of everywhere. You see him on Facebook, bro. He might be in the helicopter. Then he might see him again. He on the beach. Then you see him again. He in prison. Then you see him again, he at my grandma's house. <laughs> He'd be like, God damn. Uh, Uncle Spring, you made it to the room in front of you. you got For that. real, bro. Like, that nigga is, bro. He, man, he gonna see this shit. He watch this shit. He coming out of time. Oh, no, that's right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he watch this shit. He know, man. That's my aunt. He uh, knows shit. I fuck with him. Oh, shit. That's fine as hell. Search your righteousness. Yeah, man. Uncle motherfucker, man. But shout out to Uncle, man. He know who I'm talking about, man. That nigga, hell, bro. But yo, yeah, that's, that's funny, crazy huh? as fuck, bro. But <laughs> you're speaking of criminals, my nigga. How the fuck Colorado get beat and robbed in the same game? Beat and them nigga robbed. came back to the locker room. They they locker room had got broke into and all they jewelry and shit stole. That phones. nigga said, "Oh, nigga, you think oh, they do y'all? I want that." Yeah. What? You you think it was set happen? up? You think what you think? Yeah, it was goddamn niggas and bold out this hole. For real? Yes. It's niggas in Boulder out this hole and goddamn. Damn. What does that mean? Damn, Boulder, Colorado. You know, goddamn. Deion oh. Sanders. He been bringing all them goddamn niggas who ain't never been with goddamn. We got some, oh, he got some Rogers oh, ass, some Shice ass, some goddamn. Yeah. Some of the young niggas. Some of the young niggas. ass partners out this hole. Yeah. So, hey, niggas, all 52 of the ass. And the coach is going to be at the game right now. Facts. He ain't trying to run off in this hole. Man, they got cameras and shit, man. Fuck that. Yeah. I know this nigga Jerry, I know his locker room, they probably only robbed like three niggas. They probably robbed both of the Sonny brothers and goddamn Travis yeah. That's crazy as hell, bro. I was like, damn, who? You would think you got a police officer, somebody who just out here got a presence outside the locker room or somewhere at least, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, who, who, you know, somebody had to be in on this shit. Who left the door open? Who opened the door? Was it a forced entry to the locker room? Ain't no niggas at no football games that beating me crowbar on no I'm dope. I'm about to say, is it, is it locked though? The locker room will be locked. But I'm but saying- they Sunday, even think about doing. So like, from my experience in playing sports, everywhere we didn't play sports, like by the locker room, you're going to use to have like the medical staff, the ambulance, all that shit parked by your locker room because in case they got to get somebody the fuck out of there, they got to go in there and get your shit, whatever, whatever. So you would think that it's a, at least a EMT Somebody who like, hey, these, you know, look like they supposed to. I mean, they don't gotta be no judge. They can look like they go, hey, but these niggas like they up in trouble. Mm. They probably walk in that whole club and shit. Probably on the offensive line and partners. Okay, I need to keep talking that shit. All right, bet. Yo. Got something behind that. Then, then again, you don't have no cameras in the locker room, at least at the door. I know you can't have no camera back with nobody getting dressed and all that shit, but at least at the door, you know what I'm saying? 
Like, come on, bro. Like, y'all got all that money, bro. Y'all ain't got no camera, no way to play that shit back. Cause then the same shit happened to Dion at Jackson State. I don't know. When they had the game and his shit got stole. His know. jewelry and all that shit. So I mean, that's you know, crazy. I mean, they probably is on camera, but you know, thief is a fucking thief. Yeah, yeah. He's gonna find a way to steal this shit. Yo, I'm gonna I just, take it. I thought that shit was crazy, bro. Like the <laughs> same shit. You put all the locks and shit that you want to. Yeah, I'm gonna steal this. <laughs> yeah, <I'm laughs> hey, shit. yeah, that one I'm determined to do this. Especially, yeah. goddamn, I'm just worried about being on camera, nigga. I'm never fucking coming back to Boulder, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shit. I have no reason to be up this old. This shit is out of fucking. Yeah, especially y'all don't got no just good description of me. Yeah, 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 it's a tall, slender guy. Well, he had on a cap <laughs> with a hoodie down. Right, right, right. Wow, I'll never be again if I identify me. Yeah, that's wild as fuck, bro. Nah, I never had a reason to come back to him. I'd have been mad as hell, bro. I'd have been mad, motherfucker. I mean, I hope they got some insurance on that shit. Sad. Yeah, y'all would hope they got insurance. Then you again, you took an L too. Like, no nigga frustrated because they can't win no more. But hey, man, say man, shit, this shit smelling kind of funky, man. But it is what it is. Got to keep it well, funky. I still got my jewelry I can go to. Yeah, hey, yeah, yeah I'm I'm like, like shit, bro. Niggas still have money doing what they do, but that football field, that shit starting to get a little ugly, bro. But hopefully they shake back. Hopefully they find they got them way to overcome because they got a couple of hard ass games coming up. Yeah, cool. Our yeah. beautiful trip. Yeah. Oh, speaking of getting robbed too, man. You seen um, yeah, wow, well, yeah, what you watch boxing? No, but oh I yeah, that they robbed Fury and Francis. Francis. They robbed Francis, bro. He dropped Fury ass. Cause you seen that nigga face? Yeah. Now how the fuck know? did that happen? Yeah, yeah, but shit, they let the white boy win. Goddamn, wow. awesome. He the he the world boxing champion. Yeah, the black dude. He coming from MMA and that's his debut. Mm. Tight shit, so they gave the guy. They down. couldn't fuck up the face of box, and he got his ass beat up. And you know, Francis was training with Mike Tyson. He was training with that one for real, like that's know. a big nigga. I, but you took it out. That's that he on the sit four with shit and buddy shit nine, but they ain't look like no big ass height different though. I wouldn't just want Francis punching on me, bro. Like I mean, I wouldn't want that one of them new punching on me. Yeah, man, dude. <laughs> six nine. Yeah. yeah. Who is six nine? Tyson Fury. Yeah. Oh my god. He like a big ass white boy. Like he an out of shape six nine. Yeah, I'm saying he don't three, look in three. box and shape. <laughs> he like he about three eighty five out there. Oh god, he looks slouchy big. as fuck. Like yeah. that. Yeah, he yeah he ain't no put together, no well built. He hey, not. he ain't no well built. Got that nigga Francis ass Jack. That bitch big as fuck. For sure. Man, I'm speaking of that though, you seen that big ass? Oh, what that nigga name is? Cord Kane Cone. He on the baby security. Oh yeah, the Kane big ass nigga with the tattoos and shit. You see yeah. him punch that white boy? Uh-uh. Oh, I did see that. Huh? Mm-hmm. For the white boy to be there, the white boy was talking. Like, yeah, but it don't seem like he was there talking shit. It seemed like he was trying to explain something. But the punch is there, but shit, he got right back up though. I'm like, damn, that's a big mm-hmm. ass nigga for the white boy. Like, that's the you not to knock him out. That's the adrenaline. That's the adrenaline, cuz. I mean, but still though, nigga can be the white dude didn't have no intentions to fight. He couldn't have had no time. And he probably just got a mean ass right. lawsuit, though. That shit on camera, he got a mean ass case. I can talk to you all I want to, bitch. You ain't got to hit me. <laughs> so I said, but it wasn't necessarily just talking crazy. Yeah, hell. Oh, that's even more young. Was, it looked like he was trying to explain. So like he was like, hey, yeah, man, Kyle man. Morgan and Morgan. Where the Mark and Keith? And somebody. See, I was on the scenario. Morgan and Morgan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Call yeah you said, Mike Slocum, <laughs> Alabama Ham. I just I don't give a fuck who you got. Oh, no, one of them niggas on that goddamn. Yeah. Oh, that's serious. Yeah. Somebody gonna look at this video and be like, we got a case, goddamn. On my yeah. sixth date. You no, know, everything. But yo, yeah, so that's crazy fuck. I'm glad the white boy didn't get hurt, bro. Yeah, but he got hurt back up. Now, you would think that would have knocked this ass out. Allegedly, that the white boy was being aggressive with the security. Security just punched him. Oh, okay. So oh. he was securing somebody. Or he was oh, just no, by himself. He was, suppo- he was somebody's security guard. They say he was Jack Daughter, the other white boy security guard. But like the nigga, he I don't know. No, he mm-hmm. looked like the nigga had the goddamn punch his ass. Yeah, he could have just walked away because he is a big dude. That's a big ass. He was nigga, short, man. or he was just who? He was tall and husky. Or he was just husky. Who the dude? Yeah. Oh no, nah, that nigga was like a big ass. Yeah, he looked like he used he to play ball. Yeah, no, big ass nigga. No way. That's crazy hell yeah, though. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't condone no violence, man. Don't put your hands on nobody, man. Cause folk get the goddamn shooting and 
it ain't a hey, you out it's out of your control after you hit somebody it's all the way out of your control bro so whatever weird. they choose to do after that you signed up for it bro so listen just keep your hands to yourself feel like mm-hmm. you want to fight walk away and let a nigga touch you first defend yourself by all means but so don't start no shit <laughs> because you get to hitting on people and people ain't in no fight mood that's your ass bro mm-hmm. and you get poked up whatever happened happened shit. But nah, we ain't gonna wish that on nobody, man. Sorry. For sure. But nah, real shit though, man. What's some goddamn problems y'all got as adults that nobody prepared you for in life, bro? Come on, we just gotta have a therapy session. All of this shit. Nigga <laughs> <laughs> said nobody prepared. Yeah, some problems you have in life that nobody prepared for. None you for. of this shit. I ain't know it was this bad. Yeah. Buying a car. I used to think people was lying about how long that process is. That shit feels Ooh. like the long, and I only test drove two cars. Yeah, and that shit still took half of my day up. Yeah, all them papers and shit you had to sign. I used to think people was dead ass lying. Like, yeah, that shit all you clear your schedule. You going to buy a car? Unless you just got damn got the best A one credit in the Oh my, unless you buying cash. Yeah, you buying cash, niggas in and out. Hey, bro, I don't need nothing but the fucking title. Got <laughs> yeah, receipt. and the keys. My receipt out of this bitch. Facts. Well, you got to call the bank and find do all this and I feel got and all this shit. Yeah, you got to call the general and all this shit. They don't want you. Oh, fuck. Y'all gonna be, how much to start? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much is that now? God damn! Hey, when the nigga tell you so it's gonna be six hundred today, then one twenty nine a month for the next hundred eighty months. Nigga, like nigga, what six hundred today? <laughs> Shit! Ah, uh, don't let you be in there putting something down on that. You be wanting a nigga with a full cover, yeah. You get that full cover, don't pay on this bitch no more. God damn! I don't got no insurance on this hoe. Nigga be riding hot in two years. For real, bro. That's you gotta crazy. get your tab. The tag is you got to get that. Yeah, that nigga gonna be two hundred, three hundred dollars. Yeah, you got twenty days to get your tag. Shit, twenty. Mm. <laughs> you a bold motherfucker. You ride around with no tag, bro. Go oh, get your God. tag. Don't be out here riding around with no tag, bro. The police will stop your ass if you got that roll off tag on their months after you buy your car. Well, my shit. I seen somebody with the uh, roll off tag and they had a damn dent in the back. I said, now nah, y'all done had that help for too long. Oh, God. Unless you just got hit as soon as you came out the lot. Yeah. They say a lot of people falling behind on their car payments, though. I seen that shit online. We, I was reading somewhere. They were like, this the highest, like, uh, what is called repo rate ever where yeah. people falling behind on their car payments. Well, shit. Shit fucking high. Them niggas not paying no more money. Yeah. Car payments high as fuck. You paying, if you got a car that's over. A 2014 <laughs> baby. Yo had paying about six hundred, seven hundred dollars. I feel like if you going out on your shit, you ain't finna be Unless you got some A1 credit or this your yeah, first oh yeah, car. It is that credit though. Yeah, it's you got some credit. A1, A1 credit then yo, but sure. if you go in that bitch sixteen goddamn five, eight, yo had paying about six fifty. The banks is Hanging up on man, oh God, boy, your ass can go through a thousand banks. She gonna get tired of that man hanging up on. Her phone. <laughs> all right, look how you been. Yeah, that would be waiting on. They got that. They go through all the banks and see. <laughs> hey, I let this nigga got the hell yeah. twenty five thousand dollars get this time. They got a four eighty got the hell. He ain't the last time though. No, that bitch is repossession with me right now. <laughs> They like hell no. Nah. Hey, tell that nigga out there who can't do it this time. All right, well, call the other nigga. <laughs> call the general, little bro. Shit, the sergeant. Hey, y'all want to goddamn? Y'all trust this nigga? We got to tell seven year old, seventy two month payment. Goddamn, pay this nigga back five hundred sheets and six dollars a month. Hell no. Nah. Hey man, you know what? Bro? I appreciate y'all. I got that helping, man. That's like I just go buy him, pay him, play. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so- yeah. Then they be got them struggling. They like, damn, bro. So you say you wet now? We got one in repossession. All right, all right, all right, right. look. <laughs> this we can do. Yeah. Day. If you can put out eight or nine hundred dollars, <laughs> bitch. Fuck, nigga, if I had if I had eight or nine hundred dollars, would have been this motherfucker this long. Talk to me out of here. Bitch, I got five hundred dollars to put that on this motherfucker. Maybe some if I scratch this bitch out and don't pay for light. It's like, I gotta get out nigga eight hundred dollars, cuz I still gotta get insurance on this bitch. And I'm gonna call my folks to see if they put me on insurance before I got there again. Yeah, hey, he got me some loot holes. Hey, shit, bro. You said if I something. can't take something off this old car. <laughs> yeah. This nigga got a dinner. Hey, you start cussing. They be a perfect tattoo. Hey, shit. Now we, 
Now we talking about it. This motherfucker was little that shaky was, on the brakes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was a nigga leading the line with the basic model. He didn't draw the goddamn SIT. He, <laughs> <laughs> he leaned up in V6 like a motherfucker. They've been right to have a much foul up out He said, This is scat, man. Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. I said, No. I think I got down. Let me that be stop. That be so stop. That be like a room car. All I need on moon roof. That be like a room car. I need no 20 inch rim. <laughs> I want no DUBs on that car. Give me a 16 inch rim, bro. <laughs> 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 Hey, that nigga around <laughs> like a rental car, bro. Oh, oh shit. shit. Oh. For real. That high B. Hey, nigga, nigga I think I'm talking that shit. I think I'm hooking that hoe up. Man, when you finally get to talk to shit, but you know I can goddamn put little headers on here, shit. Yeah. You know, have more hook power with a little goddamn B8. Nah, my nigga. <laughs> I do I like, it, man. You ain't trying to get You ain't got to convince me. Bro. Yeah. Mm mm. Nigga, don't buy me an SRT, man. Yo, I got the basic V6 pack. <laughs> Regular everyday working today and like this hoe. Oh shit. Boy, yo that crazy. Man, that's some real shit yep. though, listen, man. Buying yeah, a yeah. fucking car. That's some shit you not mother if you have not been through that process, go to YouTube and watch you a video. That shit is the and, and that, shit and in the world. That's just the day. Well, yeah. the thing about buying a fucking house. That shit yeah. take fucking six but months out this hoe. Yeah, you gotta yeah, find yeah. the house, then you gotta find the fucking uh, mm-hmm. real estate agent, and then you gotta got down. Can't spend this amount of money in right. a certain amount of days. All the money can come in your bank account, the ones you've been having, you can't have no big surge of money coming. Yeah. God damn, <laughs> nigga, you gotta regulate. Uh, as soon right. as you want the house and you got everything together, the house will back off the market. Hell yeah. You got to bid with a nigga and they don't tell you what the other nigga bid is. You going to yeah. look at the house today, I go look at it tomorrow. They say they got another bid and you got to put in the bid. Yeah. I don't See know what the other nigga bid is. I got bid him. I mean, we can't. Can't disclose all that. No, God damn. Well, fuck, give them 3000 over the market. Nah, they, you got beat. Yeah, how? You ain't come find out. They put that down 500 Eskimo dollars on top of what you got. Yeah, down, that's it. That shit real, bro. That shit Man, real. That shit, taxes. Ooh, taxes. taxes. I yeah. probably owe right now. Yeah. I don't know who the fuck did my taxes last year, but um, yeah. somebody referred it. Nigga be so bad. Taxes come around, nigga tell they mama. Nigga be 30 years old, got them mom. He got my W-2s and shit. I wish I could. That's the time when I wish that crazy. I could do that type of shit. Yeah. Get on oh, turbo wow. tax. We don't know, man. They walking through that shit step man, by step. Turbo tax. <laughs> I be trying to see how them folk be getting them big ass tax refunds. They be getting ten thousand, twelve thousand. Like, that's true. Yeah. That's true. Oh yeah, them couple. Just have a bunch of fucking kids. Yeah. Then my fuck cousin, yeah. one motherfucker about ten thousand. Goddamn. Damn. Motherfucker, yeah, not one job. That ain't enjoyable though. Cause you yeah, gotta bust just, it, yeah, you got to bust it down. You could have just made. It. Yeah, forty thousand dollars throughout the whole year, or whatever. Now you just got one ten thousand dollars. That's true. That you finna go buy a bullshit car with. <laughs> yeah, that ain't nobody else want. Oh, I got me a nice car. That motherfucker. That motherfucker. If you get the tapping, goddamn, two months yeah. later, I did this. It's a lemon. You ain't know it's a lemon. That's all. They on side of the road running hot. Now, look, smoke. baby, that way you won't see too many people these cars. Goddamn, <laughs> this yeah. what happens to them? Nigga, the then about to tell me this car got bad lips. <laughs> Nigga bought a Dodge and traffic. It's some bullshit. You might do better. You do better buy the ninety three hundred cool. How yeah. this bitch? With some cold AC shit, you in the game, nigga. Nah, that's funny as hell though, bro. Do some real. That's some real shit. I'm trying to think of any more. Like shit. I mean, Money management. Yeah. Which I mean, they like. I feel like parents and like people try to kind of like tell us how to maneuver with that, but like once you actually get the money and it's in your hands, using it and dispersing it properly, especially when you're young, is the hardest thing yeah. ever in life. No, yeah, I can believe that. Yeah, especially like people who are 35, 40, 50 who don't even know how to money manage. So yeah. You ain't got no money no well making you no money. Or you ain't got no shit to put your money into. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like both of them would be bad. Too much money, not enough money. Yeah. Cause you can still have bad money, man, with both of them, but goddamn. Right. Yeah, man, this how people win the lottery and go back broke. Mm-hmm. As crazy as it sounds, nigga crazy, win the lottery, man. nigga be up two hundred million and uh-huh. go back broke. 
Trump. Trump. He used to be broke people. There only be no guys like, oh, Donald Trump won, Floyd Mayweather won it. Yeah. They might win a bet or something in Vegas, yeah. but guys down. The lottery, that shit, that be some fun shit. Nigga try guys down. I got yeah. two dollars and I don't mind. Place y'all niggas time behind me. Yeah, let me get uh three of them power balls, get six of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just try to got to get fifteen dollars or point three out of this home. That real. And they always say getting more money ain't the answer to poor money management. Some people feel like I don't it ain't that my money management poor, it's just I ain't got enough money, but it's like nah. Man, that's all yeah. That is some of the shit. If I make a thousand dollars a month and the shit got down coming out to fifteen hundred dollars a month, yeah, something is gonna get skipped over. Yeah, the something gonna get partially paid out this whole right. Gotta have some other space. Gotta have some. Well, you don't gotta have no transportation, but shit. Yeah, you gotta get around some type of way. That's true. You, you gotta got to go feel. Yeah. Gotta eat. Yeah. You gotta got that you feel me? And I hate to say it, but shit, niggas, man, you can go with the nigga gonna want that DOC now. You oh, gotta, you, gonna, you gotta that, put that in yeah. your budget. Don't fuck with all the people, you know. You, nigga say, nah, you gotta, you gotta put that in your budget. Out, yo. <laughs> Whether yeah. that shit be drinking, smoking weed, goddamn vaping, cigarettes, <laughs> black miles. You gotta have to push your DOC in your goddamn in your budget. Your DOC. You might not budget. have to get. You might not might not be able to get no Newport one hundred. Yeah, right. But you can get, you some, get some, some this or that. Some this or that. That's what that shit called. This. this. Yeah, them this I think I said, I ain't never no been that, bro. We yeah. Said, Damn, I ain't never no been this, bro. Look at a pack of this out there, though. Yeah. But yo, yeah, you might have to get the dollar ninety nine cigarettes. Yeah. Might have to buy you some Lucy's. You can't get a whole pack. They pay you 50 cents and get you got down to them. get that $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $2. $
Yeah. But I did not. I did see IHOP was on there. I would go to IHOP on a first date, probably like on some late night shit. Yeah. Or some early, early morning shit. That's for breakfast date. <laughs> yeah. I think it just went. I think it went crazy because the lady who was in the video, whatever, was it the Cheesecake Factory or some shit? Mm, oh, yeah, Cheesecake Factory. And I'm like, damn. That's, that's actually crazy. a nice place. Like, and yeah. the food is not spectacular. I definitely wouldn't mm. be there just for giving me a cheesecake after I ate, but. Yeah. That ain't just no. I wouldn't consider that no thoughtless date. You know what I'm saying? Like, if somebody like, okay, boom, you go to the Cheesecake. Even as a dude, if you met a chick and she was like, nigga, I'll take you out. Yeah. Whatever. And she like, hey, we're going to go to the Cheesecake Factory. He's like, that ain't no way you'd be like, damn. It's like, but a nigga could cook for me and I'd be all right. So yeah. I don't know. <clears throat> but what if he can't cook though? What if you eat that if shit? If he can't like, cook, damn. I'm definitely not coming back to eat for no food unless you yeah. invite me. I'm going to offer to cook. Yeah. But if you can not cook, oh, baby, we can cook. We ain't, we ain't even got to go on no day. Like, just bring yeah. me a plate. Nigga save some money on that shit. But, um. Uh, Look, <laughs> nigga took him a brief intermission idea. That nigga so crazy. How you feel about it, Tino? Man, we got that. I'm finna hop in the car. We finna got that go. We finna go. <laughs> what you talking about? That nigga <laughs> said we finna go. We finna go. Hey, but um, <clears throat> I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't take. I wouldn't take nobody to the buffet on my first date. Like. I want to take nobody to go to Corral. Go to Corral, but I was like, not not. Nah, that's like we already locked in. Like, yeah, like <laughs> yeah, we got our age. Hey, let's go get something to eat. Let's go to the buffet. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I already know you like that kind of oh, shit. Yo, yeah, 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 that's true. That's true. But now I'm gonna go and have to pick. I'm gonna have to work and make my own play on my first day. That's crazy. Yeah, but yeah, there ain't no guy. Yeah, me and uh, fifteen hundred along the road. Yeah, yeah, hey, yo, yo. That that be right though. Yo, so yeah, that um, be packed too. Yeah, yeah, that, that's a good play now. I went good shit. Mm-hmm. I, I do need to go back. I, I, I ain't been there since I was a kid, bro. Yeah. That's crazy. Oh shit. Yeah, that you gotta be hungry, yeah. bro. Cause you'll go to the buffet and don't even eat a lot. You yeah. be like, I ain't damn, lie. bro. I did do that. That shit be pissing you off. I mean, that 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 damn, I went that to that big pay sixteen on. Yeah, and ate a eight piece hot wings and celery and rent. Damn. I've been to CC's in the, since I was kids. Or y'all been CC pizza? Yeah. I haven't been, but nah. shit, I ain't want nothing out that hoe, but that cheesy Italian I'm bread. So but weak. that shit, they'll melt in your mouth, nigga. I ain't gonna. That shit be hot with that crispy white. edge. Well, yeah, that ain't no, no pizza place, y'all. Somebody take you to a pizza place with her. This ain't no goddamn feed trip. <laughs> yeah, that <laughs> shit. Fan of Sign Permission Shield coming this on. Yo. So shit, but, I'm gonna go ahead. My fault, my fault. Well, yeah, I think of Bowling Alley, uh-huh. the movies, got down. What's some other shit that was on there? They said that was on there? I think a Bowling said, Alley yeah. bad? Yeah, I seen the Bowling Alley. There's a couple things on, on the list. I'm like, like damn, bitch, you want to have fun? <laughs> what the fuck can I you take know, you? A lot of these people are just like in that city girl mentality. I mean, when you're not a city girl and you're trying to fulfill a man who can put that um yeah. on the table, that nigga's not going to want to fuck with you. Third date, take me to Dubai, <laughs> nigga. You ain't Bitch, talking about nothing. You have no stamps on your we can talk on the jet. asking me to take you <laughs> We can Dubai. talk on the jet. I'm saying, what oh we going to do at Dubai? <laughs> We're going to still have to do something. We'll have to eat somewhere and do some shit there, too, as well. <laughs> like, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you think we gonna go to Dubai and just be in, we're gonna be in a hotel room? Yeah, we just taking pictures. Motherfucker be wanting to take pictures, bro. They shit like for photo op. I want they what they call they shit. They location to be authentic. Like, what kind of bullshit I'm, is I'm, I'm this? I'm a girl, girl, oh. so I support anybody who you feel me is popping shit. Okay, boom. <laughs> we got got down from one to twenty eight. Mm-hmm. Cheesecake Factory, Applebee's, Chili's, <laughs> Chipotle, Olive Garden, the movies, your house. Any fast food chain, Buffalo Wild Wings, Wingstop, Red Lobster, a buffet, IHOP, Dennis, the gym, church, the devil, oh Starbucks, <laughs> coffee dates, ice cream dates, family functions, church moving night, crazy. somewhere that requires a long drive, bowling, <laughs> nightclub, hookah bar, a bar for just drinks, Waffle House, and sports events. Bitch! Man, let's what just, the fuck man, do you let's, out there want to go? Let's just have sex and do it, baby. Let's just <laughs> have sex, baby. Come on. Let's just fuck us on. Come on, baby. Look. A look. Man. We finna go to a hotel. I did not hear a hotel on that hotel. I can't. We finna yeah, go to a room. I can understand. And we gonna fuck us on. 
and you can keep the room for the night Only and I'm finna fucking go. You right. got it. Check out in the morning at 10. Don't let them fuck you. Get that, that house, goddamn. Yeah, yeah. You. Bitch, I'll swing back by here and check out my damn self. What? Man, you crazy hell, bro. No. We finna go fuck. It's over. There's nothing else. So to what do. about supposed to be meant? We finna go see goddamn the Lakers play goddamn. Kevin Durant and the goddamn yeah, son. Man, out there, bitch. We, crazy. Crazy. We, we 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 on the man. we on the court. Man, you getting to call my nuts, my lap. Oh, man, what's up? Man, what's up? <laughs> Fuck all this. I can't take you nowhere. I got the list on the dad, boy. All that shit up there. Look, I can't do none of it. So this is all I got. I'm about, yeah, they need they need to put a, uh, the acceptable list then, what, what they think. Yeah, we so, need to compare this shit to reality. Yeah, you feel me? And see, yeah, like, like, bitch, like, no. Bitch, what? You want to go on a hundred trip? Like, what you fuck you want to do? I don't know. I don't want to jet ski. Have been so far around it, that's crazy, bro. You want to go? What a nigga said, T Pain. You want to go yeah, goddamn skin? I, like, I feel like their intentions was to put that list out and make the just spark, a conversation piece, spark an interest upon men to maybe be a little bit more creative with their dates. She, oh, oh that's creative. You to kill the nigga whole. They didn't say an aquarium. They didn't say um, a picnic. See, they didn't you need say to go on that a put, show need... in the park. See, yeah. you, need to, you need to put out the goddamn rebuttal list. <laughs> yeah, hell, shit. Yeah, put out the answer. They didn't say skating. Yeah, nature walk. Nature walk. They didn't say um like a culinary class where you could. But go bowling got skating on it. Well, not all. No, that nigga no. said bowling got skating. You could do like a paint, no, no, no. sip and paint. Yeah. Um, type shit. It's a lot of stuff they didn't name on there. But what if you not not. Like, what if I don't like you that much? Like, what, what if, if I only... That's what you... But that's not... If you're dating somebody, then your intentions no. are possibly to become one in a relationship. If you just fucking, then you just fucking. But dating, what if through our conversation, I'm just like, uh-huh, you don't give me sipping paint, but I will get you an apple bean. We go out the game and get 2 for 20 and shit. Like, that's fucked up. But no my real feelings. How is that fucked up? Well, she, that's just up to her to fuck with you or not. But she yeah. can't go to Applebee's and be like, oh, I hate niggas who take me to Applebee's. Bitch, you went. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Type shit. Like, okay. I, I, I or if that. she just, uh, after that fact, don't want to fuck mm-hmm. with you, and she's like, okay, well, you think I'm an Applebee's ass bitch. It's just trying not to no. fuck with you. That's just how it is. Like, I'm mad as fuck. I could take me to Applebee's. I see a goddamn. <laughs> Oh, the shit, shit, what you got there? I see them all on social media. Broke ass nigga, fuck nigga took me to Applebee. Yeah. I was swipe all that shit off my plate. Give this motherfucking food, bitch. Give me that goddamn dollar amount of real. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Blow all that shit out. Yeah. Fuck wrong with you, bitch. You better talk about me after I leave out this hoe. After you drive back to our separate locations, goddamn. You ain't gonna be making no tweets and goddamn spouting. Instagram story about Hey, me. you gotta tell your notifications on, on all yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get a burner account on your ass. <laughs> I'm gonna probably let me know this bitch post something, goddamn. What'd she say? <laughs> she better just be like, first date, I'm nervous. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, first date. Well, she's like, oh, okay. She just showed the plate. All right, bitch, bitch. Yeah, bitch. she can't say no fuck shit. This is Tina. Hey, she like, what wrong with you? She hey. already know. <laughs> she gonna be tripping every time she tweets on your phone, Blake. She gonna be like, what the fuck? Oh man, hey, go to the private me. store, my new. Hey, I'm about to say, hey, what that, what that green store is? Yeah, the one you can't see, guys. I don't know. What's the motherfucker that say about me? <laughs> I'm trying, nigga. I gotta make sure you. I gotta make sure you feel me right. Just like each other first before I take it to one life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, what's your limit on the first date? Like, what's what's your limit? How long? <laughs> Maybe, oh <my> one <laughs> Maybe one fifty. Maybe one fifty. Max. Oh yeah, max. Max. <laughs> Drinks and all. Yeah, that's everything. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta make sure I ride this. This is a test drive. Yeah, facts. <laughs> That's what we do. Go on a test drive. Yeah. You go on a test drive, you're not finna put no fucking fool for taking this bitch. Yeah, man. I mean, you're not finna put no reality, but goddamn, you ain't finna put no fool for taking the drive, goddamn. You feel me? This motherfucker drive a little rough. Yeah, this yeah. This motherfucker okay. stank after goddamn five miles after driving. It smell like ass in this bitch. Yo, the windshield wipers don't work. Goddamn. You start seeing that the reality light light out. shit. Terror signal don't work as good as goddamn. <laughs> mm-hmm. This bitch ain't as fast as I thought it was. That's real. That's really hell. That nigga said it was just a test drive, bro. This is a trial period. You don't spend goddamn the full amount of no trial. Yeah. What's the minimum? 
I mean, I ain't gonna no say it. I type like zero dollars. I probably got the shit out of the freezer. Yo, I'm saying I ain't gonna. I wouldn't say no date though. Yeah, I wouldn't call. I wouldn't call it no date. Mm-hmm. The motherfucker just came to the house. I said, yeah. And I probably just might have been cooking. I ain't never just your know, first date. Come over and I'm gonna cook for it. Yeah. You ain't never set it up like on no romantic type shit. Hell no. Yeah. That's real. That's real. I just thought that list was a bit crazy. Because that shit, like, literally X'd out everything. There's nothing else to do but have sex. It did not X out everything. Make parlay sheets or some <laughs> shit. I don't know. Like, what are we fucking on the coloring book, crossword puzzle? Mm -hmm. All that. They ain't say, oh, you right. They ain't have no Uno and all that shit. Play Uno, do some other shit. Oh, I might, I might, I might take my motherfucker, my pop crib, the first date, first place I take you to your dad house. Yup, I'm gonna see a pop fuck with you. Yeah, I'm gonna see if you say, "I see you, son." Or if you just got down, yeah, boy, all right. <laughs> yeah, hey, <laughs> yeah. Hey, he said two totally different things. Yo, hey, for real. Man, what you mean by that? Yeah, what you mean? <laughs> yeah, facts. That's real. That real the fuck nigga say shit. That I ain't get no good validation. If a nigga say shit, all right, are well, you gonna stop talking to her? I, I might just ask him. <laughs> like, what you, <laughs> what she, you mean? She ain't looking good. The other ones, so you ain't fuck with a vibe, man. Yeah. Like, she, I mean, if you just like, I mean, she is, son. Everybody like what they like. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know that what he gonna say to me? Got down. Hey, son. You know I can't got down. Hey. I don't know where you're grown, man. I, you know, I used to know you when you were young. I know you, everybody pa, grew up. Pa got hit me with the shit. It's like, oh, you fine. Yeah, yeah. Okay, all right. You might be all right. I'm fucking with you for a second. Yeah. That real. That real. Damn, my nigga. I hope she don't, goddamn. Nah, Tino, never mind, man. You know how your dad is, man. He gonna let you know. I appreciate him. And he watched this show, man. Shout out, bitch. Oh, yeah, man. For sure, man. For I real. did that done. He be yeah. on that truck watching our shit, man. Shout and out me to the Lily, toilet, man. man. Shout out me Lily for the show. Shout out to the toilet. <laughs> he said to the toilet. Shout out to the bathroom, man. Oh, that way he be watching shit on his iPad? Nah, hell no. Oh, damn. I mean, he probably do that, right, but I ain't got Nah, that's what I was saying, bro. Yeah. Nah, he put the toilet in the basement. He put the toilet in the basement. Man, shout out to Pop, man. It's Pop got the whole crib. I don't want to, I don't want to, I ain't going to give it some money. It might, well, it might not be up cold. Mm. Oh, man, yo, don't get Pop in trouble like the whole man. Nah, Sorry. for real, man. That shit too funny. Oh, yeah, too. I do want to say, man, oh, she was fucked up, bro, did it in my Get all them people at the Walmart and shit. Mm -hmm. Oh, That's yeah. That shit. Yeah. yeah. I don't believe he did. They yeah, shot himself. Yeah, they shot himself. I don't believe that shit. Throw the body. You say you don't believe it? Oh, Show the body. Man. I believe believing that shit be government plants and shit. I mean, but even if it was, the niggas dead now. Like, even that dead plant, they gotta say show that. the body. I don't you say you don't believe he dead. I don't believe because. Oh, 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 okay, okay. I believe that they said that shit just to, all right, call the dogs off. Now he got them, got a new identity. He gone to fucking Czechoslovakia or somewhere. He out of here. What you think they'll do that for? What, who's that <laughs> reason behind that? Population control, man. Show who in control. Show that they don't give a fuck no more, bro. Man, already only got fucking 1,500 people up there. Yeah, way. so we'll kill them then. Imagine what we'll do to the rest of you motherfuckers. 22 people? Yeah. Take over. He, they, it's, just some, it's just some real shit, bro. It's some power trip type shit, bro. I do you think? I'm about to say, too, you can get deep with that. Yeah. Do you think he ain't killed anybody? He can't. Don't know. nobody fucking know nobody in Maine. Yeah, we ain't seen shit. Don't nobody got no family members from fucking Maine. Yeah, bro. I don't want to know anybody living in Maine. Mm, I, I never knew been, nobody who got there with I ain't never been known from Maine, Vermont, none of that shit. So, hey, I don't know, bro. You know, I'm a conspiracy type of nigga, bro. Y'all need to see the whole picture. Just like we was talking in the morning about goddamn, like, you know how, like, you ever watch, like, an old, like, old movie that started off with, like, slavery type of shit you'd be like bro who the fuck was recording this shit then you'd be like well shit it, it don't make sense bro because are you talking about real life 
Yeah, like, where they like have slavery like, going on. Yeah, they have like real footage of like old shit, like in the eighteen hundreds and shit. You ain't never seen movies and shit like that. Yeah, no. Like documentaries and shit, where they be like, well, "This is such and such field, eighteen thirty eight, and it be like actual footage." Some niggas out there be working. Yeah, but it's real now. Don't, bro. That what I'm saying, like, bro. Cameras yeah, and was, shit. That what I'm saying. Nah, I don't nah. think that shit was meant to be real. No, nah, I'm saying like just like niggas have fucking like footage of like World War One and shit like that, bro. Who was filming this shit? They had camera back then. They had like journalists back then. But like they okay. had camera back in the 1800s. So I watched some shit this morning, bro. They had footage from like some slavery shit on that. Well, from when? 18 late 1800s. Yeah, they had some camera. It wasn't no camera quarter. And who killed this shit? Sacred all these years and say we gonna need this shit 200 years. From they just like this family heirloom. Man, I don't be man. Like some shit, they record now. Got down that shit passed down generation to generation. Man. They can pick up with somebody and got down. I don't believe all that shit thousands of years ago. Yeah. Damn, who the fuck keeping that torch alive? Got down. Yeah, I mean, yeah. shit two hundred years ago. I don't know, Tino. I don't know, cause I'm like, who fucking on who recording this shit? He's just the safest nigga in the world. Bro, you don't know that white people keep fucking they they are so very statistical and fucking numbers. Analytic. Like, the last time that Tom Brady threw a pass past thirty yards to a receiver that was six foot six was back in nineteen ninety nine when he first got drafted. And it was not negative six degrees. Yeah. Who the fuck knows that? Yeah, you right. They keep up with shit like that. They keep up with numbers and all that shit that you feel. Yeah, regular motherfuckers on have the stats on. I said that shit before. I like. I wish I had the stats on, on like my my life. Yeah, I never think about that. Like if I had stats on, how much how much how much alcohol have I consumed throughout my goddamn drinking days? Yeah. How much money have I spent from goddamn? I don't think I want to know. Man. How much goddamn? You feel me? I be, I be on stats on my shit. That shit. Might how many make miles have I done drove out there though? How many hours I done worked at my job? Yeah, he was a white folk that got got all this shit. Yeah, <laughs> wrote down somewhere, and they say, "Oh, well, I think you got to be at a certain job though." But like, when you get Social Security, then they tell you like how long you been working, and like how much money you don't made. Yeah, and I think you get like percentage of that shit back. Well, how the fuck that shit work? But right. you know, this nigga I told me like he made like nine hundred and ninety nine thousand dollars since he been working type shit. Damn, and you get a certain amount of that money back in Social Security. How the fuck that shit work? Yeah, we have to research and get the facts on that shit. That made sense though. Yeah, the niggas have you store a potato. No, I wouldn't want to keep the facts. The Vatican and know. shit. Yeah, the yeah. Vatican has a lot of fucking data in that bitch. I could believe it. People keep shit with that down. They said they got mm-hmm. seeds in some fucking vault somewhere. Got down. So if something happened. That bitch was uh, that shit survive a nuclear bomb. They can replant goddamn the seeds in the vault. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's some scary shit out like, 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 The nigga like us can't think about. Yeah. Nigga, we gotta think about next fucking week. <laughs> yeah, fact. Now, tomorrow. Fuck, I'm gonna pay these goddamn yeah. Yeah. But yeah. that rent finna come through. Yeah. Okay, boom. I'll get paid on the first. But see, that third. I'm gonna have to pay that guy down 10% on that fucking rent. Yeah, fuck. hell yeah. But shit, fuck it. I have one. We ain't got the competitive time to think about shit like that. Why don't have me what I'm finna do, goddamn, 20, 30 years from now? Yeah. That really blows me. I might punch your ass in the face. How do you I... see yourself in 20? Oh, nigga, I don't know. I don't even know where the fuck I'm gonna be tomorrow. Yeah. Hope I'm still out this whole kicking it, goddamn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's some real shit though. That's why they be ahead, but them folk planned out the twenty two hundred out this so We think about tomorrow. Yeah, you feel like, so okay, I believe I just them. Pay rent. My phone bill just texts me telling me about some shit. It's supposed to be duped in two. Nigga weeks. making promise to pay like, on the fucking phone money. bill. And, and, and your phone got that Charlie for that tip they said. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Doing doing eighty two cents. Hey, like, hey is- fuck, nigga, tell me, got tell me. I know I pay. Hey, yeah. this random send ass dollar. Send me an email, nigga. Yeah. Man, that's some real shit. Oh, my, they gonna let you know. Hey, shit. Well, hey, well, fine. You shit gonna pay it, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you chicken, make sure that, man. I don't hey, want y'all to have it, man. 
The phone company ain't gonna let you miss that hoe, bro. Especially if you with Verizon, but I'm fucking gonna send y'all like, everything in the yeah. world. That's the only thing, boy. They can't be late on. Yeah, that phone bill. Be late on a lot of shit. Yeah, but that shit, you know, ain't got to put up a motherfucking arrangement. Okay? Yeah, <laughs> Man, you got to goddamn pay that payment. Bitch. It ain't no you two months behind on your phone Hell bill. Hell no, nah, them boy cut that bitch slap off. Your shit get yeah, going that slow. Do, do, do. Yeah, man. <laughs> Reconnect to the T-Mobile. Yeah. Please I was actually asking no other questions. You don't say, God damn, you need a new phone or nothing. I'm like, yo, you got an outstanding bill, $29, $3. How would you like to pay it? Nothing you going to say. Shit. No, Please don't hang up. They're going to blow your shit off. Yeah. I'm like, God damn, yeah. bitch. I'm, I got your 50 funky funky ass dollars. Dang, I wish. Just shit. give me a minute. All I, all I have is Wi Fi. Oh, I don't have power. I was going to say, I thought you were talking about your cell phone bill. Oh, no, no, no. I'm like, talking about no. my spectrum, the Wi Fi. Oh, Wi Fi, yeah. yeah. Hell yeah, no, nah, yeah. I wish my phone bill was $50. No folks, we've been redirected to the financial department. No folks, <laughs> tell that quick. <laughs> yeah, gonna hang up. Shit. Oh, I knew how old I had. It's old. And they got smart. They start calling all random as something. They don't yeah. do the one they hunted yeah, all the time. They, they call like, from the like, local number. Like yeah. <laughs> they, they, got, they get a text free number. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hello? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, nigga, you think we'll be with it? Hey, we got that money, huh? We you, up in here. Yeah, you answering because you've been applying for jobs and shit. So you got it. Hello? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, this is our credit one. Yeah. Fuck. Let me got my <laughs> You've been, you been recording on the line. <laughs> <laughs> you've been recording on the personal line. Let's see, how you doing today? Damn, nigga. What kind of outstanding bill that you have? Oh, God. Family, bro, I didn't pay the fucking regular folks. Uh. <laughs> yeah. It's old. Would you like to set up a payment or anything? Nah, I'm good. I'll call y'all back. So it's about to get cut off. All right, bro. I don't want to accept that shit out. Don't cut that whole off. Yeah, bro. do what you're going to yeah, do, man. I ain't no nigga going to accept this face. Yeah. I thought y'all would have been cutting them yeah. off. Yeah. <laughs> I really got a couple more days out of this bitch on straight. Nah. Don't let them nigga already have another plan. I'm yeah. I'm going about this whole anyway. Break my leaves. Fuck it. Yeah. I took the wall off the light. I don't give a damn. <laughs> yeah, I never get that money out of me no more. <laughs> nigga credit be fucked up for the next 20 years trying to fight. Man, y'all niggas crazy, bro. Nah, yeah, that's that life for you, though. Yeah, that should that should have happened to you, bro. Just try to stay afloat, best you can, man. What else y'all got before we get up out of the night, man? Oh, shit. Damn, everybody out, man. Hey, I'm uh -oh. nah, That was a funny shit. Nah, you wild as hell, man. That Most was a funny shit. Man. Nah, I, 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 mean, I don't got none. I just want to say a statement. <laughs> What's up? Nah, I just don't like what people got done. Like, with somebody... Like you on a game show, goddamn, like uh, after a fight or something, and they be, they ask that question, then they you feel me? Why folks don't ever like to just let the mic go? Because <laughs> like, they don't want you to talk too long. Because it's a reporter, you're not supposed to just be like, yeah. yo ass wanna, hey, I got something to say. They don't like, want to just keep, that's not their they gonna pull it out in case you say some bullshit. <laughs> Like, like that should be that should be pissing me off. Yeah, that wasn't no thing. I just say that wasn't no thing that make me you feel me, make me mad. Yeah, that shouldn't make me mad. Yeah. I ain't say I need. I ain't say I. That's funny. It's funny. But it's like one of those things. I be seeing people. I be watching little shorts and shit. Oh, they be like, yeah, no goddamn, but they still be. I be like, man, I want. Well, give me goddamn, I'm gonna give your shit back. <laughs> yeah, see, that's why. Yeah, that that's exactly why. That's exactly no, I'm about like, oh, like you got there, got the mic. You asked me a question. I'm like, yeah. See, I'm like, see you why are you touching the fucking mic? If I got there trying to talk, they like, bro, I'm gonna tuck that off yeah, with their head. They trying to put it on your mic. Because they on the fucking time now, schedule. They was like, here, you go ahead. You get up here and oh, get yeah, the shout out the hood and all this shit. They got shit to do, man. Oh, like, that's that's that one I'm I ain't saying I'm right. Yeah. I don't care about being wrong, guys. Right I don't like that shit. Yeah. They better not give me the opportunity. I'm not talking to them. I can't grab that bitch from you. I'm going to just stop talking and walk off. <laughs> hey, that's funny, though. Don't you got them? Yeah. <laughs> And then you feel me, so you, you snatch the mic back when I know. Nah, bitch, I might still be in the middle of my... See, yeah. that's the point. That's the whole but then point. That's when then what you want me to talk for? <laughs> and nigga might want you to answer you, a question. You only answer and say what's at the end asked. No, nah, you trying to get that. This is not that. You ain't gonna lie. If I'm it was that. a sit down, okay, but these are yeah. the red carpets and shit. You talking about. Nah, that's real though, bro. Real. Everybody got that one pet peeve, though. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. My pet peeve, you know, yeah. this shit, like, that. Yeah, I'm gonna be, be liking people do this. Oh, 
I hate when nigga leave a nigga hanging on the handshake. That shit is so cringy, bro. When nigga reach out for a handshake and nigga right just just don't like like miss that shit. I be like, ah, nigga, go shake a nigga hand, like, bro. Ah. Ah, uh, yeah, nigga be like, yeah, oh, I hate that shit. I hate when a nigga miss a handshake, boy. Oh, my goodness. That's why I hate to watch the end of, like, games and shit when they walk into the locker room. And some of them niggas be like, hey, like, hey, they miss it. I be like, that shit's so cringy, bro. Yeah, and I'm like, get your attention, bro. Hey, bro, I was trying to shake your hand, bro. Hey, <laughs> hey for real. I hate that shit. Trying to go show it out. Right? <laughs> yeah, for real. Hey, bro, before you go, bro. You got to fit bump me or something, bro. Don't just leave me hanging, bro. For real. Mm. Wow, I hate wow, when you bro. make a joke with somebody and they get on defense mode like you was yeah. talking about them when the joke had nothing to do with them. Yeah. I know you ain't over there laughing. Damn, <laughs> like, What the fuck? Thanks. Yeah. What the fuck you laughing at, bitch? The joke you just made. Get back in the fuck. fight, man. Don't worry about me, bitch. I'm, I'm just laughing to be laughing. You ain't got nothing to say to them. God right? <laughs> damn. Oh, you, oh, you think it's funny? Oh, yeah, yeah you gotta pick on the weaker opponent. Yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah. shit, you got to get the best you out there. I know he ain't laughing. Damn, nigga. Especially you already had, see, most times I already had something to say about you. Yeah, and nice. And that there ain't no guy out there. Okay, bitch. Hey, join Gabba, bitch. Mother, you better not laugh over there. Yeah. You better have some jokes in your ass. Yeah. Deflection. That's real as fuck. That <laughs> real, buddy. So they get to laugh, man. Y'all yeah. yeah, need crazy as fuck. Mm -hmm. Man, motivate these people before we get up out of here tonight, man. What y'all got, bro? She in deep thought. She rubbing her chin, mm -hmm. goddamn. She in thinking mode. That motivation I got, <laughs> motherfucking December 1st. Yo. Goddamn, December 1st. Round two. That motherfucking mic. Mm -hmm. Round two. December 1st. Yo. We got motherfucking rematch of the yeah. goddamn uh, RMG spelling B. You did. Going down at motherfucking... Uptown Jazz. Uptown Lounge. motherfucking funk you up. Uptown funk you up. <laughs> Yo, Uptown Jazz Lounge. Uptown Jazz Lounge, you did. Yo. December 1st. We in there. We need goddamn contestants. We need motherfucking judges. Yeah. We got down, hey. Y'all come goddamn win out some money. Hey, we might up the cash prize this time. What was last time? $100? Yeah, $100. Yeah, you $100. Yeah, what we, we might up that bit to 200 Yeah, we'll see. Fuck it. Come get your $200 at the goddamn spelling beat. I'm a motivation. Yeah, yeah right. I had to spell some words. I'm telling you, what you got for on lick? Uh, shit. <laughs> give him something goddamn bad. Bad? Or just give him a statement. Ah, just give him a statement. Just have fun with this shit, for real, for real. Yeah, no you matter can, what you yeah, do. Yeah, you could stack and have fun with this shit. Don't yeah. ever let nobody bring you down for having fun with this nah, shit. So that Especially real. if you ain't got no big responsibilities. Keep living. Yeah. For sure. Yeah, yeah, man. And I'm going to leave y'all start overthinking and start doing, man. For so I came to a personal realization today, and I'm, I'm going to share it with the world, man. You got you to gotta take the time, bro. Sometimes I feel like you fucked up. You're sitting in a dead spot, but that's the time to focus, rebrand, reevaluate, and expand your shit and go harder, man. Hey, until next week, man. Hey, like Tino said, too, before we go, adult spelling be round two. That shit going crazy. Uptown Jazz Lounge, December 1st. BWB Squad, man. We definitely need contestants, DJs. Got them. Now we don't need DJ. We got DJ, my bad. But we definitely need goddamn judges and all that other good shit. Also, look, be on the lookout for the merch, man. We're going to have a pop up table at the Spelling B. You can get merch like last time. And we're going to definitely have a couple other vendors there, man, for sure. Shout out to LaFleur Coffee Boutique. Man, super dope brand. I want to give her a shout out, man. She's super dope. Um, she definitely want to got them be a sponsor, right, to the media group. So we want to shout her out for sure. She's going to send us some product. Um, I don't drink coffee, but we know a lot of people who do. I so do. shout out LaFleur Coffee. Oh, see, I drank coffee at the oh, hospital. Yeah. That's the only time I drank yeah. coffee. Yeah. It's at the hospital. We finna have a whole bunch of it, man. But, hey, look, right to see the <laughs> podcast on IG. Go follow us, right to media group on goddamn YouTube. Go comment, like, subscribe. Until next week, we gone.